Questions to ask your doctor about metabolic syndrome. One thing to realize about any health condition is that even though our bodies seem the same, everyone is different. Because of this, medications and diet affect everyone differently. These questions can give you ideas on what to ask but be sure to also ask specific questions about your case as they arise. 1. What are the complications of metabolic syndrome? Each person is at risk for different types of consequences and complications from metabolic syndrome. It could range from heart disease to diabetes to stroke and depending on how these conditions are managed can inform how much complication it causes. 2. Are there any genetic influences for me that I should be concerned about? Each family is different, so you'll likely need to find out about family history by asking. However, they may not know about the terminology so you might instead look at illnesses like stroke, high blood pressure, diabetes, and heart disease to determine if there is a genetic component. You can learn how to help your children prevent problems using diet and exercise too. 3. Is my weight a factor in my condition? Asking about weight is a good place to start if you know you're overweight. If you're not overweight, it's likely not a factor for you, but that doesn't mean your diet isn't an issue. You can also ask about that. 60% of obese individuals in the USA have metabolic syndrome too. 4. Can you recommend any support groups to help me? There could be support groups that your doctor knows about local to you that will help. Remember that you can also find some online if you don't want to go in person. 5. What are the warning signs of heart disease? Asking your doctor to clarify any warning signs that you may have for heart disease and how to combat them is a good thing to do, because it addresses one of the major illnesses associated with metabolic syndrome. The symptoms can be very different for everyone. 6. What are the warning signs of diabetes? If you're not sure about your symptoms, asking about the warning signs to look for if you're worried about diabetes is a good way to help manage your problem. Urinating a lot, drinking a lot, and feeling a lack of energy should be brought up regardless of test results. 7. What are some ways to lower my blood pressure? Your doctor may want to prescribe medication but also ask about natural ways to lower your blood pressure like meditation, walking, and even coloring. 8. I'm confused about cholesterol, can you explain it? Cholesterol is confusing because they're always changing the criteria about what is considered a good level. But getting to an understanding of good cholesterol and bad cholesterol and how it relates to illness can help. 9. What are the ways I can prevent stroke? Knowing not only the signs of stroke but also how to prevent them is a good thing and asking your doctor what they recommend is important because they are most aware of your situation over general advice to eat right move and report symptoms. The best thing to do is to write down the questions you want to ask your healthcare professional or doctor. You will likely forget while you're in the office because you'll feel rushed. If you write down the questions, you can note the answers they give so that you don't forget anything that is causing you concern.